So I work with a lot of small business owners and self-employed clients, and I understand those folks because I am the self-employed small business owner. Unlike some people in my business who did not build their own practice and clientele, some people in my business went out and got a job and they're employee advisors, but I've lived it. So I've gone out to the networking events. I have spent so much of my career with these self-employed small business owners and I've had to build my business just like you did. So I understand what it's like to struggle. I understand what it's like to have lean years. I understand what it's like to have irregularity in income where some months you're doing really well and some months you're not. But the small business owner has to take care and wants to take care of their future. And unlike people who go to a job and you show up and they say, okay, well, here's your 401k and here's your, here's your benefits. No, a small business owner has to create that for themselves. And so that's what we help small business owners with. We help them with setting up retirement plans and benefits for themselves, taking care of and retaining key employees, if that's something that's important to the business owners, and then figuring out, okay, how do we start taking income from this business to create personal wealth? Because frankly, that's why a lot of people are in business to begin with, is they wanna be able to build wealth and build their future. And the value of the business matters. That goes into the equation because in some cases we may have a business that we can sell and help fund our retirement. But oftentimes, if you look at the valuation figures on most businesses, uh, you're not going to retire on just the sale of the business. Uh, there's the need to also have that other component, that wealth creation, that savings and investments alongside. So I've been there. I've lived it for 22 years, I understand you, and I enjoy working with small business, self-employed people.